I'm a fellowship trained functional neurosurgeon and what that means is I restore function, specifically focusing on things like Parkinson's and essential tremor. When somebody has essential tremor, the time to undergo a procedure, such as MRI guided focused ultrasound, would be when that tremor negatively impacts your quality of life. For some people, that's when the tremor is very mild. And other po folks will say, you know, it. It's reached a point where I can't write, I can't sign my check, I can't eat, I can't feed myself, I can't drink a, a glass of wine. And so that continuum is different for every person. And that's what's so important is doing a procedure that's right for you at the right time. Today was our 100th procedure, which is so exciting and rewarding for us. I think we are the only the sixth site in the country to achieve 100. The tremors I first noticed just uh, as far as eating, uh, maybe trying to eat soup or trying to drink coffee with one hand and then it's, it's just, at first I thought it was, well, just maybe nerves or something and then it just progressed uh, to the point where it was affecting other parts of my, my life. I'd say the hardest aspect uh, is writing uh, and it's, it's kind of weird. There, there's a bunch of little things like checking in hotels, uh, you know, where you have to fill out the little card with your uh, license and registration, and also having to um, just write checks and just little things like that. Um, you know, they're small, but they're very impactful. So essentially, what we do is we focus anywhere between 800 to 1100 different ultrasound beams through the skull. As they pass through the brain, they don't damage the brain, but when they converge on a spot, they heat the brain up. That particular spot in the brain is a part of a circuit that controls tremor. And so when we burn that permanent hole in the brain, we disrupt that circuit and take somebody from an essential tremor to 70% or greater improvement in their tremor. It's different than other treatments. It's, it's a very elegant way to treat tremor from a surgical perspective because it does not require any implanted devices and it doesn't require any incisions. So it's safe. I'm feeling great. Um, it's, you know, totally there's no discomfort or, or anything. This is pretty new to me um, since, you know, I just had the procedure within the last hour or so. Um, I'm sure it's going to be life-changing on, on many different levels. I mean, I'm just amazed at how much of an improvement it made in such a short period of time. I guess any advice I would give to someone that is thinking about this procedure, do your research, um, have a consult visit with Dr. Beasley, Honestly, the most gratifying thing to me is that this is an immediate result. A patient will walk in one way with a tremor and walk out being able to sign their name. Their lives forever change. That just warms everyone's heart, makes it worthwhile.